closed. What is that? <laughs> it's a package. <gasps> Welcome to God's Karens. Today we get to unbox something that I have been waiting for. It is my Nook Nova fire place i just want to say thank you to nick nova for hooking me up with this fireplace because y'all i lost mine in the eye of the hurricane if you saw that vlog check it out my whole basement just got tanked right and i had a fireplace because i absolutely love having fireplaces in my home and nook nova saw the need and hooked the sister up so today we get to unbox it we get to use it we get to test it out and co-host is gonna help me co-host you wanna help me yeah and guys if you don't know mommy dyed her hair i did dye my hair and i'm wearing a sweater to match my hair it is what it is let's start unboxing all right guys so here we go Carlos, are you ready to unbox this yeah let's get ready First, we've got the instructions packaged. Because nobody wants to put a fireplace with no instructions. Okay. All right, so this is a 20 inch electric fireplace stove model number XAA0002001. Pad out. There it is. It comes with some screws in the back. Screw so, them on. What does it say on the, on the very back? All right, so this comes, I guess, in pieces. So let's take it out completely and assemble it. And get this bad boy together. Right? Right? Mm -hmm. This is packaged really, really well. So. Because nobody wants to ruin their new thing. No, so I, I don't want to like mess this up, taking it out of the box. Oh boy. It's a fireplace. Oh, no, it's a fireplace. <laughs> wow, really thankful for this fireplace. Yeah, that's a great <laughs> have unboxed the unit and I like it. It has like this like matted black finish, which I love anything that is matted and black. As you have seen on my uh, Casa Karen's videos, I like black as an accent color in my home. I don't have too much black because then it just gets too overbearing, but I like black. Okay, so directions say, Place the fireplace upside down on a padded surface with the underside accessible. So we're on our rug. Put it this way. Okay, backwards now or upside down. Then it says attach the leg to the bottom of the fireplace. So I've got my four legs. And it has these little grooves in it. So it's like, you know, dummy proof, right? You can't make a mistake with this. <laughs> Okay, well, you gotta line it up like a puzzle, right? Okay, and then I'm gonna do this press it in. Though. I'm gonna do okay. it.
So we have finished attaching the legs. We did run into a problem and that, that this leg right here, the screws don't thread. So there's supposed to be three screws per leg. And Only one, one, well, yeah, we lost one. I don't know where it is, but two of the screws won't thread. So now this wobbles. So we'll see what happens. I, I hear it, there it is. All right, yeah, we found the screw. We found the missing screw. Let's see if this one will thread. All right, so that screw threaded through. The other one still won't thread, so it's not as wobbly. Let's turn this bad boy around. And let's see how it stands. so here it is it's really adorable it's got the controls right here on the inside we can change the temperature here like right now the heat just kicked in and it's really warm I could feel it feels nice feels cozy um, I can lower it and it will shut itself off because you know it's on a different setting uh, let's see here there we go we just shut off the heat we just shut off the little light in the back I want to turn it back on I like it all right guys so there you have it that's the Nook Nova fireplace 20 inches it is cute it is compact what are my thoughts on this I like it, it's warm. It has a really, really powerful heater on the bottom. We did have a little bit of an issue with one of the screws. It just was not threading. Doesn't matter how hard we tried, it just wasn't going through. But everything else uh, was easy to put together. Like I showed you before, the controls are nicely hidden on the inside. Will I keep this here in my dining room? No, I think I'm gonna actually put it up in my kids room i think it's the perfect size for my kids room so co-host what are your thoughts my thoughts are that this has a layer so we can like like put like one candle on top of here we probably could put a candle on top of here but i'm not sure i would want a candle to be so accessible to my children <laughs> but, but but I don't want to put this in my room because because I have my own fireplace. Yes, she has her own fireplace. But regardless, this bad boy is most likely going to go upstairs in one of the bedrooms um, because it is absolutely cute. So, Nick Nova, thank you so much for hooking us up with this beautiful little fire stove. Go check them out. I will link them down below in the description box. I can't wait to use this this stove this winter because it is already starting to get cold where I live if you have stuck it out this far give it a thumbs up subscribe hit that notification bell icon comment below tell me your thoughts do you like having fireplaces or fire stoves like this in your home for those of us that can't have a real fireplace this is the next best thing thank you guys for watching love you